welcome to this special series of Earth from Space interviews on the European Space Agency Web TV. Thousands of people are currently debating possible political countermeasures to climate change at the COP21 summit in Paris. The UN Framework Convention on Climate Change has long recognized the need for global observations of so-called essential climate variables, which we at ESA are providing from satellite data within its climate change initiative. Some of the leading scientists on the essential climate variables have been kind enough to explain just what they're measuring within their project, why it's needed, and what it is good for. Let's go take a look. Burn areas is one of the um, important factors uh, for the global ecosystem. It affects the emissions, I mean the atmospheric chemistry, because fire is an important source of um, greenhouse gases and aerosols, and also affects vegetation dynamics and carbon uh, stocks, particularly in tropical regions where fire is used for deforestation. We are working with three satellites, ERS, MBSAT, and Spot Vegetation. Um, the idea is to produce burn area maps uh, of, uh, for a long time series of, of data sets from 97 to 2009. We have produced the first burn area map based on MERIS data. It has not been done before. And we have been also uh, merging uh, data from different sensors to produce an improved burn area estimation worldwide. Well, we are still uh, trying to improve the burn area algorithms because uh, the burn signal is, is quite diverse globally. Um, in tropical regions, it lasts very shortly. In boreal regions, it's much uh, longer. And, and therefore, it's, it's quite difficult to do global algorithms because the, the regional variations are, are quite quite averse. 